We're recording. Okay. Start by loading feeding the wire through the hole and tying a knot. Okay, so there's a little hole in the shuttle and you have to tie a knot to hold it on there. Helps to have small fingers. Tweezers. Yeah. What you really need. There you go. All right, that's tied. All right. Access, if you can, just take it off or clip it off. Well, I got those cutters over here. Yeah. Yeah, you should have had everything you need. Is there any second counts? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, now we're going to load. When you load, you load the shuttle in reverse. Now, how many turns are you putting on? I'll tell you in a second here. I forgot what it was. Oh, all right. Oh, just whatever was set at before? You have 35 for your load. 35 turns of what size wire? Uh, this is their wire, whatever it was. Was, 41. It, 42, was it 42? Or? 41. 41 wire. Before you take the wire, break the wire, you put on the slider. The wire slider? The wire slider has to be put on. In which way does the hook go? The hook is facing down. Okay, to the back of the machine. You feed it from the front and slide it through. Okay, so you push it through. I see. And then... Does the whole thing go in? Yep. Oh, and then you hook the wire up through it? Uh, your wire comes down. And you hook your wire through the hook on the front of the slider. Okay. So there it is. Now you can break your wire. So now you, you break the wire. You come down through. Wrap your wire around the core. And then make one wrap. Don't hold the wire very tight. Oh yeah, there it is. Just we'll allow it to come around the side plate. That's good. Once that's loaded, close the side close arm. Close the side arm. You don't want very much tension on the side arm. Now you're ready to wind. Before, prior to winding, feed the wire through back side of the shuttle. Put your machine to forward and then start. That's winding nicely. Pick up the speed just a little bit. Now, even though it takes a lot of time to get this set up from scratch, once it's set up, it will be able to run um, as many cores as you want. It's just the setup time is very fussy. Um, tell, tell them some of the things you have to do, like like adjusting the tail, the tension on the tail. Uh, of the, uh, um, that doesn't need to be adjusted so much as just setting it up, getting everything aligned right. Yeah. And that stop prior to the loop. Oh, and then feed it back through again. Yeah, so when you you're done with the first turn. Yeah, first layer. I know some companies run right over the wire. You know? Well, you don't want to run your lead into it. They have 600 turns on here. You didn't have this many turns on the last time. You just went much around. What happened on that? Is it, I broke it up because it was bunching. It was over. It was uh, back looping. Oh. So how many loops is this going to make? That's 300 turns. Oh, there's a 300 right there. Okay, we're going to end the video here. Sorry it's so long, but uh, it took us a while to get the first part started.